anyone can have fun while participating in a sport or a physical activity. It's finding those activities that you will truly enjoy that could take some time. Once you identify an activity that is fun and enjoyable for you, finding the motivation to do it regularly won't even be an issue anymore. If you think that running could be one of your favorite activities just like me, listen to those pointers that could help you keep it fun and exciting. Always remember that as a runner, you are unique. You can be the girl who runs fast, the one who runs slowly, the one that loves extra long runs, the one who wants to walk her dog, the one who likes to enjoy the scenery, or the runner that prefers window shopping. You are you and who you are is just perfect. You don't have to be the best in the world, you're the best in your world. Did you know that you can run almost anywhere? For sure, running in circles in a gym is not the most exciting thing ever. You could try running on a treadmill, in the stairwells, in the streets where you could discover new neighborhoods. You could also try running in trails and build your own obstacle courses through the rocks, the trees and roots. Even if your best friend is a fan of evening runs, it's possible that her timing is wrong for you. I personally prefer to go for a jog early in the morning, as early as 5 a.m. But I know many great runners who would never accompany me that early. Find your time. Ever heard of rock sex? Of course you've never heard of them, because you were not born in the 70s like me. When I was in high school, I owned that huge yellow Walkman and I would use it to run while singing along to rock set songs so loud. I loved it so much. If music makes you move, work on your champion playlist and run. If you have a cell phone, look for the many free apps that could help you track your progression. You could even share your runs with friends and other runners all around the world. If technology is not your thing, using a plain old calendar will definitely do the trick. You can use it to write down a summary of your accomplishments, runs in pinks, strength training in yellow maybe. You could even find some stickers and stick a shiny star on days when you feel particularly proud of yourself. A great way to increase the level of enjoyment that you might experience through running is to feel the satisfaction that results from reaching your goals. And of course, the first step in that process is to make sure that you have taken the time to identify what those objectives are. But careful, if your goal is too challenging, it could pull you down if you're struggling too much to reach it. Your goal should be realistic and attainable while being challenging enough to push you forward. Your objective should also be measurable. Instead of saying, my goal is to run more often, think of the current frequency of your runs and add some more. Write down your objectives where you will see them often, in your agenda or in your phone maybe. Running can be hard sometimes. There will be some days when you feel too hot, short of breath, weak on your legs, Fun is just not there and you're not exactly sure why. It's normal, that's just life and everyone goes through rough patches. But these are times when you need to be stubborn. Read through your objectives again and ask a friend to go for a walk with you. You can do this.